What's up guys? Welcome to today's video and welcome to my channel if you are new. Happy five days out. It is Monday and I'm feeling pretty good. I actually, I was a little bit bloated this morning when I did my check-in, which you guys just saw. Though I feel bloated, I do still feel like I'm seeing new lines and I feel better. So hopefully it was just a weird digestion thing and that's it but i am heading downstairs very shortly to do my first session of cardio i only have one today technically but she might add in another one this evening so i'll keep you guys posted it's just supposed to be one hour today yesterday was supposed to be two 45 minute sessions i ended up doing two hour sessions and no training today is supposed to be one one hour session and leg day so i'm really excited to get back into the gym and training again because we did take two days off due to the double cardio for three days in a row so very excited to get back in the gym but um today i have to work so i'm doing a split shift so this morning after my cardio i'm doing a couple of hours in the gym then i have pretty much the day to do whatever when it comes to training eating resting running errands all of that and i'm back working again 5 30 to 8 30 and then that's pretty much going to be it for today no real major plans but i'm going to take you guys along with me as per usual so you'll see what i'm eating you'll see anything that i do and hopefully i get some training clips in this week for you guys too but just want to give you a little bit of a rundown i do have a posing session with day raja around 11 i believe so i'm going to talk to her a little bit about the plan for this week and if she changes anything or has anything to say i'll update you guys So I have the blonde roast today, so I'm excited to try this one out. I just got this at the grocery store. I'm going to mix up one of these coffees. I already have my lemon water and glutamine here in this shaker. The shaker is empty, but I'm taking it downstairs because I have my Hydra Surge, my EAAs, and my Reds are downstairs. And then I have this one liter, or one and a half liter, sorry, water bottle, which I'm going to start using to help track my water because I'm trying to get five to six liters today. So that is my plan. I'm going to bring all this downstairs with me to the gym. And then we have our oats in the microwave here. Be careful, guys, because sometimes they like to spill. Just stir it periodically. Actually, they look pretty done. But my oats there. Nut butter here. And I'm going to add this to my coffee. And there is breakfast, coffee, and vitamins. So I'm gonna eat this and then go do some cardio. water here now you guys saw my snack so i did two rice cakes and i mixed up some creamy peanut butter and i also did 30 grams i think of plain fat free greek yogurt some stevia and it kind of just makes the peanut butter go a longer way and makes it creamier the stevia helps to make it a little bit sweet so it kind of just tastes like a little sweet treat so that would normally be something like my pre-workout meal but i was feeling a little bit lower energy so I decided to have a little snack and I honestly just slid down I had, I had like a little 35 minute nap my friends are gone out for a little walk and I just booked my nail appointment so I kind of forgot 
that I had to get my nails done and I haven't got my nails done I don't think since last time I competed in 2019 it's been a minute I actually miss it so I might continue to get them done but my hands are like little boy hands right now so I was just like you know what I'm gonna get them done today so I booked my nail appointment for three o'clock and then I have to do with the rest of my cardio and then I'm gonna go back to work for a few hours so my plan I'm training legs today and I really just want to have an amazing workout it's my last full lower body day of this week to go hard and I don't know I'm gonna keep intensity high for training for the rest of the week there's no need for me to back off obviously I don't want to be super sore and stiff so stretching and rest and recovery is gonna be really important but I'm gonna give it my all all week anyways so I'm training legs today and I'm super excited but I was feeling a little tired so I just took a bit of a little power nap I guess and I'm gonna probably eat some dinner and then I'm gonna go work out. So I'm gonna do legs downstairs. Then we're gonna go to our nail appointment. Then we're gonna finish off our cardio work and probably just watch a movie with the girls tonight. I think we're all gonna come here and hang out, spend some time together. Cause they've been kind of go, go, go since they got here from Newfoundland, which is of course normal. But we haven't really done anything chill together and just like hung out. So I think that's what the plan is for tonight. So I'm super excited about that because it's something that I could participate in. And I was going to hang out with them last night, but I honestly was so drained. And I just wanted to go to bed. But calories are higher today. We have a little increase in carbs, a little increase in fats. Energy and spirits are higher today because we're getting closer and closer to show day. And I want to just spend some time with them before I head back to Newfoundland in a few days. So I did a posing session with Dayraja about 40 minutes to an hour hour ago so when I came up from work she was ready to go so she facetimed me I ran through my routine with her she said everything looks good she really didn't make any tweaks or anything like that she's kind of like you're pretty much good to go uh, I talked to her a bit about the plan for post show and into next peak week because I am competing at Moncton next weekend too so it's Newfoundland this weekend and Moncton the next weekend and I just wanted to know kind of what she thought my protocol was gonna be so we discussed that a little bit and I honestly think the plan is to have like a free meal after the show Saturday night have a couple bites of whatever just don't overdo it Sunday I will check back in with her I have a photo shoot plan so I really don't want to overdo it Saturday night anyways and then Monday will probably deplete and Tuesday and Wednesday and then Thursday Friday will carve back up again and head out to compete in Moncton so that's kind of the plan but who knows of course I will update you guys with how that goes but for this peak week we're gonna continue on lowering cardio every day and increasing food Food every day so after checking in this morning uh, everything was looking pretty good so she was like let's keep calories increased so we're doing 100 carb 45 fat 140 protein today so increased and she was like I keep cardio at 160 minute session and I can break it up if I want so this morning I did 20 minutes and then this evening before I go back to work I'm gonna do my 40 minutes and then I'm gonna work and edit and chill with the girls so trying to keep myself pretty busy I feel like the downtime can be hit or miss with me so that's kind of when I hit my energy walls I guess when I'm just sitting around so I'm probably going to make a meal now and then just get downstairs to get this workout done while I have energy while I'm feeling motivated and ready to go that's it for now I will check in with you in a little bit you'll see what I have for my dinner meal it is 12 o'clock so I'm gonna mix that up now and um, yeah I'll see you guys in the next clip all right, so our dinner is 215 grams of green beans, string beans, it's yellow and green beans, and 130 grams of ground turkey extra lean. So I also have some mustard. I'm gonna be using this honey mustard on the side just to kind of dip the green beans in. I'm just gonna have like a serving or whatever. But yeah, uh, that's what I'm gonna have and um, that's gonna be it probably I might do another rice cake or something before my training session before I head downstairs but I'm gonna dive into this now and I'm trying to keep everything pretty consistent and pretty clean this week I'm gonna dive into this little meal and I will check back with you guys when I have my next snack or when I get down to the gym okay so the extra carbs and little nap are definitely hitting different so we're gonna go ahead and train now so i'm gonna take a little pre-workout snack and some pre this is a set from the genesis collection from tlf and i just wanted to show you guys if you didn't see my try on because i am literally obsessed with it the yellow is so nice the back of the sports bra is amazing these shorts are amazing i don't know it just it just stands out it really pops so i'm gonna do some legs this is my little gym fit that i'm gonna be wearing but let's go get a little pre-workout snack and some pre into us so we can go have a fire leg workout. So 
I took a little pre-workout snack. Cheers. already know her. I'm Hi. <laughs> and she's yourself? Her name is... I'm the girl in the phone screensaver. <laughs> I don't look like that right now. <laughs> so we're just back from our little walk. The girls are going out on scooters, like those electric scooters. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. I have a nail appointment, so it is now 2.27. My nail appointment is at three and it's about 10 to 15 minutes away. So I'm gonna mix up a little meal or snack and then I'm gonna grab a coffee. I'll probably just make one from home and do a cold brew kind of thing and then head out, get ready to go to my nail appointment. So I'll show you what I decide to have and we'll see you in the next clip. All right, so our little meal or snack is gonna be some plain fat-free Greek yogurt, mixing in a little bit of sweetener and we have some raspberries here. So we have extra carbs today, so we're gonna do a little bit of raspberries. And I also have my pineapple yayays from Jack Factory. So you guys can use my code TBT to save 20% off at Jack Factory. These are my favorite. I love them for recovery. Also just helps to flavor my water and it's good for in between meals for something sweet. So I'm gonna have this kind of while I'm getting my nails done, I guess, or before or after, depending if they let me have it in there. So I'm literally just pouring from this one and a half liter jug into my shaker and taking both of these with me when I go and my coffee, but I'm gonna mix up my yogurt now. I only have about like five, 10 minutes before I have to leave the house, so. We are heading out to get our nails done. This outfit is from Zara. It was literally like $10. The shirt was actually like five, and I think the pants were also five, but it's over. Sweater thing is from Sheen. It's Emily's actually. And good old Converse and cold brew. So heading out now, getting the nails done, getting glammed up. It is time to get things done. Um, I will show you what they look like once they're all finished. So if you follow me on Instagram, you've probably already seen these because I posted it as my story. It's kind of hard to see right now, but I just got your classic French tips, but they're kind of like the coffin style and a little glitter on my ring finger so I really like these they're super cute very simple I'm a simple girl I literally never have nails on so we'll see hopefully I can keep them on for two shows <sighs> god I hope I don't break them in the gym but 
this is what we went with very very simple very nice very cute very pretty here tooting my own horn with my nails but it is um around four i think let me just see yeah 405 so i'm gonna head back to the house i'm not hungry or anything like that i still have like half of my coffee and like a liter of water left i did drink my eaa's so I'm gonna drink the rest of my coffee. My friends are on scooters around here somewhere, so maybe I'll try to find them. I don't know, we'll take a little drive downtown and see, play some music, um, just chillax for a bit. And then I'm working 5.30 to 8.30, and I'm gonna just basically be editing these videos because I'm doing daily vlogs, so I need to like edit every single day pretty much, but it's good because it kind of keeps me occupied. And then I have another like 20 to 40 minutes of cardio to do. I'm honestly just basing it off of where my steps are by the time I go to do them because I did do that walk outside and I am trying to recover more so I don't want to do too, too much but I also am still okay with doing a little extra push today if I need to. So I'll check with Raja, see what she thinks. Otherwise, um, that's it for now. Not feeling hungry or anything like that. I'm probably gonna mix up some burn next tea in a very short minute. I highly recommend them and they're really good for just like taking them on the go like right now basically. So yeah, um, that's it for now. I will see you guys in the next clip. Me flexing my nails. Just girly things. Hopefully it goes well with my suit. I'm sure it will. But anyways, yeah, I'm rambling. So I'll check with you guys in a little bit.